15 Inspiring Facts About Steve Jobs Steve Jobs is most famous for creating Apple Inc., the multi-million dollar brand that has taken over the world, from MacBook computers to iPods and iPhones. This curious inventor was quiet about his personal life during his career, but he started to open up during his last few years. Here are 10 inspiring facts about Steve Jobs that you should know. Number 1 Steve Jobs was adopted. Steve Jobs was born on February 24, 1955, to Abdul Fattah John Dali and Joanne Scable. John Dali came from a Muslim background and Scable from a Catholic background, and they weren't married when Scable fell pregnant. Both at the University of Wisconsin at the time, Scable fled to California to have the birth. Scable put Jobs up for adoption after deciding that she should not keep the baby. Number 2 Jobs almost became a Buddhist monk. In 1974 Jobs traveled to India to stay at the Neem Karoli Ashram, seeking spiritual enlightenment. Unfortunately, upon his arrival, he had learned of Neem Karoli's death the previous year, so he altered his trip. Instead, he headed to the ashram of Haitakan Babaji, where he spent seven months before returning to the U.S. Jobs started to practice Zen Buddhism, which became a huge part of his life. At one point, he considered becoming a monk at Aheji in Japan. Number 3 Steve Jobs was a college dropout. In 1972 Jobs enrolled at Reed College but dropped out after one semester. He explained to his parents that he didn't want to waste their money on education that was meaningless to him. Jobs' adopted parents had promised his biological mother Scable that they would pay for his education. Number 4 Steve Jobs founded Apple Incorporated in 1976. Alongside Steve Wozniak, Jobs created the first Apple computer in March 1976. Wozniak designed the Apple I, and together with Jobs, they decided to sell it to the public. By April 1, 1976, the two set up Apple Computer Company as a business partnership alongside Ronald Wayne, now known as Apple Incorporated. The name Apple came from Jobs' time on the All One Farm Commune in Oregon. Jobs spent a lot of time in the apple orchard and decided that should be the company name. Number 5 Jobs named an Apple computer after his daughter. Lisa Nicole Brennan Jobs was born May 17, 1978. Jobs was not present for Lisa's birth but went to visit Brennan three days later. Together they named their daughter Lisa. Jobs then named the computer he was working on the Apple Lisa. Number 6 He married one of his students. Jobs first met his wife-to-be in 1989 during a lecture he was giving at Stanford Graduate School of Business. Loren Powell was sat in the front row of Jobs' lecture, and he couldn't keep his eyes off her. Following the lecture, Jobs met with Powell in the car park and invited her to dinner. Jobs proposed to Powell in 1990, and they married at the Iwani Hotel in Yosemite National Park on March 18, 1991. Number 7 Jobs met his biological sister at age 27. Due to being adopted as a child and not knowing his biological family, it took a long time to find out about his sister. Jobs tracked down his sister, author Mona Simpson and met when he was 27 years old. Her first book was titled Anywhere But Here, which was about her relationship with her parents, Jobs' biological family. Number 8 In 1986 Steve Jobs funded the Graphics Group, which later became Pixar. Initially, it was a sub-company under Disney until Jobs invested, and the company became its own spin-off company. The first Pixar film Toy Story, 
1995, was a joint venture with Disney, but because of Jobs' investment, it meant he was credited as executive producer. Disney bought back the company in 2006. Number 9 He has over 300 patents to his name. The exact number of patents that include Jobs' name as either sole inventor or co-inventor varies across the board. Jobs has 43 patents on inventions to his name, whilst the rest are all design-related. He has patents for speakers, staircases, packages, power adapters, phones, etc. Jobs received the patent for the Mac OS X dot user interface the day before he died. Number 10 Jobs wore the same outfit daily. Not the exact same garments, but the same style. Jobs adopted a dress code that consisted of a black turtleneck, jeans, and sneakers. His style was simple, but he became known for it. He would only wear Levi's jeans, and it is rumored that he owned around 100 pairs of them. His legacy will live on as Apple continues to create and invent. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, share and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this.